if you blink, you're gonna miss Jackson. But if you blink on a Friday night, you're gonna miss something awesome. Let's go, dominate this guy. Let's go, let's go! Hey, clap it up, clap it up, let's go! Big hit on me, ready! Big hit! Football is, it's, it's life here in, in Bradley County, in the mountains. Come on Friday nights to this, to this stadium, you'll see people that you ain't seen in weeks or months come up to a game. Cause it's just, it's, it's what we are. It's breath of football. I went to school here and played football here in the nineties. And you know, I knew uh, pretty early in high school that I wanted to be a football coach and, and uh, especially a football coach here in my hometown. We have a great community. We got a lot of support from our, from our school, our administrators. You know, the local businesses, you can't, you can't go anywhere in Jackson without them talking about uh, Breathitt County football. And, you know, Breathitt County football has it's had a good history. And, uh, you know, we're hoping that we can, can continue to, to build on that. And, and it's, you know, it's an exciting place to be a high school football coach and to play here. It's a big deal. It always has been ever since I've been in, in Jackson, but even before my time, uh, it's, it's been the heart of the, of the community for many years. I root for the Bobcats, I always have. Uh, well, since I've been in Jackson, because most of the kids, I cut their hair. So I'm, I have a personal connection with them. They're uh, real close friends and customers. So it's exciting for me to go watch them play football. I'm Laura Thomas. I'm the mayor of the city of Jackson, Jackson, Kentucky. Jackson is the county seat of Breathitt County, and we're a large county land-wise, but population is small. We've lost population over the years. We have around 13,000 people in the county, and there are about 2,300 people in the city. And uh, we're a small mountain town in eastern Kentucky. I grew up out Route 30 here, out by McDonald's. You go out there about 15 miles and turn down an old road called Canoe. And I grew up on the Middle Fork of the Kentucky River. Had three older brothers and about five friends that lived on the same road. So we spent all day, every day outside fishing, playing basketball, wiffle ball, football. It, we just spent our time outside. Then it so happened that we had to move because of jobs. Finally, it worked out for me to come home, and that's where I'm getting ready to start my senior season at. On Friday nights here in Jackson, it brings out between two and three or 4,000 people. It brings a community together. It's done a whole lot for me, and that's the biggest reason I wanted to get into coaching, uh, was to coach here at Breathitt County and, and kind of give back to the, the kids at Breathitt County what football gave to me. My three older brothers played here, and uh, I've, I've been around this program since I was eight years old. So it's really, football's been a big part of my life and the um, place is really special to me and I wouldn't have it any other way than to spend my senior year here. Walking from the locker room, underneath the bleachers, to the field, everybody smacking you in the helmet, smacking you on the pads, getting you fired up. There's nothing like it. They run out on the field hearing the uh, hot song play. It's just, it's a whole other feeling, you know. You get this, you get this feeling maybe three times in your life. When you're playing football, when you have a, have a, have a baby, when you get married. <laughs>